Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, delighted royal fans when she made a surprise appearance alongside husband Prince William at Wimbledon on Tuesday. Looking typically chic, thrifty Catherine put on an elegant display in a recycled Alessandra Riche blue polka dot midi dress, which she first wore at a local street party to celebrate the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. Prince William's famous wife completed her ensemble with a pair of slingback white-heeled sandals and coordinating mulberry handbag. Wearing her long brown locks loose, Catherine, who accessorised with a pair of dainty pearl drop earrings, kept her makeup natural. Meanwhile, Prince William looked dapper in a light grey check suit, which he paired with a navy tie and matching smart trousers. And the trip to the tournament proved to be a family affair for Catherine, as her parents, Carol and Michael Middleton, were also spotted in the royal box on centre court. Carol, 67, opted for a classic floral dress for her second outing to Southwest 19, while her husband, Michael, 73, looked dapper in a navy suit and tie. The tennis-mad couple took their seats in the royal box, a few rows away from their daughter Catherine and son-in-law Prince William. But that didn't stop Catherine from blowing a sweet kiss towards her mum and dad, with her face lighting up when she managed to clock them in their seats. TV cameras spotted her blowing the kiss and waving, at the same time Carol, who playfully poked out her tongue at her daughter and son-in-law. Holding a drink in a metal container, Catherine's mother joked with the couple in the royal box at Centre Court before they broke out in laughter. Catherine is known to be close to her mum and dad, and the Middletons are regulars at Wimbledon as they all share a love for the sport. Earlier, the Duke and Duchess were spotted waving to fans as they crossed the bridge from the Millennium Building into Centre Court after entering at the Southwest 19 grounds via the players' entrance. As the couple arrived in the royal box on Centre Court, they shook hands with David Walliams and his mother Catherine, who were sat behind them and appeared thrilled with their encounter with the royals. Both Catherine and William put on sunglasses as play started between defending champion Novak Djokovic and Italian Danique Sinner. Catherine smiled to William after a tense rally won by the Italian player, which sparked tense oohs and ahs from the crowd before a huge wave of applause. Catherine, an avid tennis player, she and William also have a court at their country home of Anmer Hall, is patron of the All England Lawn Tennis Club and typically watches matches from the Royal Box. William and Catherine's visit to Wimbledon comes as crowds of spectators are expected to flock to the tournament today to watch Norrie as the last British singles player in the tournament hopes to win his quarter-finals match. Catherine and William's unannounced arrival at Wimbledon was welcomed by royal fans who took to Twitter to praise the couple. At Amanda, 02943872 said, Stunning lady, hashtag Duchess of Cambridge. At Love for Cambridge added, They look beautiful as always. And at Oma Bell wrote, Look who arrived at Wimbledon and lit up the stadium a while ago. The royal family members attending Wimbledon today are not just Catherine and William. Another member of the family spotted in the royal box is Bridget, Duchess of Gloucester, one of the Queen's first cousins, with a working role in the royal family. The Duchess, who joined the royal family in the 1970s upon marrying Prince Richard, is likely attending the matches as the president of British tennis. Catherine's parents, who live in Berkshire, typically attend several days of Wimbledon, but are usually only invited to sit in the Royal Box once per tournament, according to the Daily Mail. The Royal Box, located on Centre Court at the legendary Southwest 19 sports venue, has 74 seats reserved for the Royal Family and invited guests of All England Lawn Tennis and Croquet Club. Wimbledon organisers, also handed out hundreds of free tickets to Ukrainian refugees in a bid to welcome them to their new homes last week. In a couple of weeks, the special ticket holders will be able to spend the day at Number One Court, an opportunity to see some amazing tennis, according to Wimbledon Foundation head Paige Murphy. She said, It's an incredibly proud moment for us. It is really part of our mission to give people a really special experience after a really traumatic few months. 
to be able to provide a unique day when they can hopefully have a bit of respite and really get some enjoyment out of it. It is incredibly inspiring for us.